Hey guys, today I'm going to be unboxing the Vault 4N. So this cube actually comes in two different factory magnetic strengths, which is pretty cool. I decided to get the stronger magnet version because I do tend to prefer stronger magnets over weaker ones. This is also an expansion to the very popular Volk cube line. It first started with the Volk 3 3x3, then the Volk 2x2, and now obviously the Volk 4x4. Both of the previous puzzles in the series have been huge successes, so I definitely have pretty high expectations for this one. So it looks like we have obviously the cube and then some sort of accessories box. So it looks like the 4x4 comes in a similar box to the 2x2. So let's just take a look at this little pouch thing first. Oh. So it looks like we have just a bunch of cards. Whoa. Yeah, so a lot of cards. As well as what looks like a microfiber cloth that might say the Vulk on it. It's pretty cool. Now let's just get into the cube box. Alright, so looks like it comes with some extra springs. Alright, let's get into the cube. There we go. So just taking a look at it, it looks like it has primary internals. Let's just get into first turns. So just right out of the box, the cube is very fast and has a very smooth feeling. The magnets are actually a pretty good strength and they don't feel too overpowering. This is also a 60mm 4x4 which kind of follows the trend of 4x4s getting smaller. So right now it is pretty loose but for corner cutting yeah so it's not that great out of the box but after setting it up it should probably be very good. So just to compare it to my current main, the Mini Wuchui M, the Vault 4 seems to have much smoother and controllable turning out of the box compared to the Mini Wuchui. I can definitely see this cube becoming my main. So yeah, this cube has a ton of potential, and I can definitely see it becoming a very good cube once I set it up. So I've been really getting into 4x4 lately, and hopefully this cube can encourage me to practice even more, and therefore get my times even faster. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, please be sure to like and subscribe for more content in the future. Thanks for watching. Bye.